So hello there and welcome back to the channel. This is Mel's Gaming here with an incredibly special The Hunter Call of the Wild video. Last night I was continuing my moose grind here on Medved Tiger in search of a big non-typical Great One moose and something really really awesome showed up. Another Great One moose but this time it is the fabled birch fur type, the one fur type I was missing for Great One Moose. It's also one of my favourite furs for the Great One Moose. I absolutely love the birch. I think it is so, so pretty. And getting to see it in game finally was absolutely incredible. I mean, what a stunning looking Great One. He is absolutely gorgeous. And I've said it before in other videos when I talked about hopefully one day seeing this fur show up on this grind that I think this fur just fits so well with Medved it being this sort of light sort of white and cream colors it is just really really beautiful and it just fits this environment so so well He's such a gorgeous moose. And he has the spider rack. I love the spider rack. It, to be honest, I love all of the racks for the Great One Moose. It's still not the big non-typical rack I'm after. But I mean, I just absolutely love this guy. I think he is so, so beautiful. The Great One Moose are my favourite Great One. So every time one of these guys shows up, I'm super, super excited. And as soon as I saw him standing in this zone, my heart just leapt. He is absolutely fantastic. Just such a gorgeous creature. I mean, an icy giant really out here on Medved with that beautiful fur coat. He's just stunning. And it's again one of these situations where actually seeing this fur in game has made me love it even more than, you know, seeing it on the live stream when these guys were revealed and in pictures because actually seeing it in game it's just absolutely gorgeous. There's so many just little delicate elements to this fur. It's beautiful. I absolutely love the white spots coming up from the belly. They look so pretty. It's just absolutely stunning. And then you have the, the darker, almost black spots throughout the rest of the coat too. Those delicate little spots just, they add so much to this fur. But I just love that that little section where you've got the white spots coming up from the belly. I think it looks so, so pretty. And it's just, this might be the prettiest looking Great One Moose fur, perhaps. Just, it's just fantastic. And I love the way that you have sort of like, like I said, the white and cream colours. And then almost like a very, very light brown, pinkish sort of colour going into the top of the coat. It's really stunning absolutely gorgeous i love it so so much and then you have these beautiful brown eyes as well on this just white face it just looks so fantastic absolutely awesome and like i said it's getting to see this in game has made me love this fur even more and i think for me it might be the most aesthetically beautiful coat for the great one moose it's just stunning to look at and i honestly i just couldn't be happier Seeing this guy show up last night is just, oh, I was so excited. Like, I say this, I get genuinely, every time I get to see a great one, I get so, so excited. It makes me, it makes me panic thinking about having to take the shot. And it gets me so excited to get close to these guys and try and take as many pictures and stuff as possible and try and get some nice pictures to use for, you know, for thumbnails, for, for backgrounds and stuff, because these guys are so gorgeous. And I think it's worth spending the time to appreciate how beautiful they really, really are. And he's just absolutely stunning. I'm so, so thrilled to finally get the birch fur type. And it's also a huge achievement for me personally. The same as when I got all of the, the Fallow Deer Great One racks. I now have all of the Great One Moose furs, so that's a huge achievement for me. I'm still missing the one rack. The only thing I do not have for the Great One Moose is that big non-typical rack, my favourite rack that I'm actually grinding for, which is, it's always funny to me. It seems to be your very favourite things that come at the very end, and I'm still going to keep grinding in hopes that I can get that rack. I have half of it on the, my first ever Great One Moose that was half the big typical rack and half the big non-typical rack. But my dream is to have a full big non-typical moose in the middle of my trophy lodge. It's my absolute favourite rack for any Great One in game. I think it just looks 
beyond incredible. So I'm going to keep grinding for that and we'll see what else shows up along the way. But huge, huge personal achievement for me to now have all of the Great One Moves furs. That is something I never thought I would get to say. And I'm really, really beyond pleased about having all of them in my lodge because they all look fantastic. I do have my favourites. The, the Ashen, the Two-Tone, the Birch and the Speckled were my favourites. But getting to see them all in game, I've come to love them pretty much all equally. I think they all look so amazing. And yeah, just like I said, taking a really good look at this guy's coat. It's so stunning. There's so many little delicate elements to it. The way that the fur blends. How fluffy it actually ends up looking. And just the different colours mixing. It's it's just gorgeous. I think the design team did such a good job on the artistry of the Great One Moose. And this fur just it goes to show how much work and love was put in. Because this is really stunning. It really is beautiful. I am so stoked about this and I'm gonna just keep saying how beautiful he is because I, I do genuinely think he is stunning. I'm so amazed at how beautiful this guy actually is. But now it came time to thinking about taking a shot. He was giving me a perfect broadside opportunity here and I just wanted to get an accurate range. He's at just about 12 meters and we're gonna take him with the 12 gauge gamekeeper shotgun with a slug. And while he was stood there giving me that perfect broadside opportunity, I managed to put a slug into his lungs and you can see he's not going very far before he actually goes down. I could see the vital blood on the ground, so I'm super, super relieved at this point that, you know, everything went well. He went down in sight, which is always really fantastic. And then I rushed over to get to him as quick as possible before the game had any chance to crash or anything like that. And just taking one final close-up look at him while he is here on the ground. And like I said, the words that just kept coming to my mind were beautiful, gorgeous, stunning. He is just beyond gorgeous. I am so, so thrilled that I have actually managed to get all of the furs for the Great One Moose. And we're actually finishing that collection with such an incredible beauty. The Fabled Birch absolutely fantastic it's definitely still one of my top favorites i love it so so much and i couldn't be happier i really really couldn't be happier so now quickly picking this guy up before anything goes wrong no crashes or anything and we have a beautiful fabled birch great one moose 191.29 score he is absolutely amazing i am so so thrilled i I don't know what else to say. I know I ramble in every single one of these videos, but it's because I get genuinely so excited about this and I, I just love it. These, these incredible great ones, they are so beautiful and I absolutely love every time I get to get to see one and get to record the footage and everything. It is always an amazing experience. It doesn't get old. It really doesn't get old. The excitement is always a huge, huge adrenaline kick. And this guy was no different. He's just absolutely beautiful. Beautiful is the word for this guy, I think. Just simply beautiful. Wow. I'm so thrilled. He's absolutely amazing. And I actually really like the combo with the spider rack. I think it looks just really sort of mystical. I really do think it has that kind of element to it with this fur. There's something about it that is just sort of otherworldly, mystical and just enchanting. It's so amazing. And this is why I love the Great One Moose. I just think they have this element to them that is, it is just so majestic. There hasn't been one single Great One Moose that I have ever seen that I've ever thought that's not impressive. You know, they are just... Every single one of them, every fur, every combo, every rack just looks amazing. And yes, while I am still chasing after that one specific rack, which is now, like I said, all I am missing for the complete collection of Great One Moose, you know, getting this and getting the other ones along the way while I'm grinding for one specific one, it's been amazing. This is more than I could hope for, you know? I, I didn't expect to have so many of these guys showing up and ever since I changed my grinding strategy as I've talked about in multiple videos 
it has really picked up the speed of my grinds. It has really, really changed things. But still, I, I haven't expected and I don't expect these guys to keep showing up. And every time they show up for me, it's a huge surprise. So it's just a hugely insane experience for me for every single one of these guys. And I just couldn't be happier. And getting to take him with the 12 gauge slugs as well was really cool. We were so close using the iron sights and everything. It was such a fantastic way, I think, to bring this guy down with just, yeah. I love the 12 gauge gamekeeper shotgun. I really do like that gun. I've used it a lot. And getting to use it to take down this guy, I think, was really, really cool personally. I was really happy to be able to bring this guy down with that. So yeah, I couldn't be happier. I really couldn't be happier. It was an absolutely incredible experience and I'm super, super happy to add this guy to the Trophy Lodge. But that is going to be it for this video. So I really hope you have enjoyed it. Sorry it's a little bit shorter, but we are going through a really bad heat wave here in the UK at the moment. And getting on to record and, you know, do grinding has been difficult. And sitting here recording, you know, without fans and stuff going, it's really, really hot. So yeah, a little bit shorter maybe than some of the other videos, but I had to get this one out because I just couldn't wait. I needed to share this guy with you all because I think he is stunning. And yeah, I am just so, so, so happy and I couldn't be happier. I'm absolutely chuffed. But that is going to be it. So thank you so, so much for watching and for all your support. As always, you are all absolutely amazing. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you.